Hello everyone. So th those of you who may already know me, my name is Mel. Um, I am the owner and creator of Mel's Divination Readings. Um, I am a fourth generation psychic and somebody who has been doing readings for m quite a while. I just wanted to take a little bit and introduce myself um, to my clients who have just found me on YouTube. Um, I have never had a YouTube channel. This is a brand new thing for me and I'm very excited. Um, it's, I'm really branching out. I work for myself now and I used to do readings and have done readings in the past on um, psychic hotlines and websites for other companies. What I do now is I now have my own website and I have my own company, which is what I just named Mel's Divination Readings. And I offer readings, I offer coaching sessions, and soon to be I hope to offer workshops. So I, what I like to do is I like to help my clients really create their potential and s empower them with seeing the future of their abilities, seeing that we are all co-creators of our reality and it really depends on how we look at things, how we choose to see our reality. For instance, I work with the law of attraction, I work with mind thought magic and really it's about positive and negative energies and how we use them. So my daily practice is about meditation. It's about using divination tools. I use tarot, I use oracle, I use runes. Um, I connect with my guides. I use um, automatic writing, and crystals and pendulum. And I like to really sit with my guides every day and connect and see what the messages are that are coming through before I even start my day. Um, I also really like to help my clients really get to a place where they don't really need me. <laughs> and it's kind of almost putting myself out of business, but I was a teacher for many, many years and that is how I like to help people. I like to help them get to a place where they're not needing as many readings, they're functioning and empowered and they have their own tools of how to get through life spiritually, emotionally, and they really know what their go-tos are and how to function. So my big goal is honesty above everything. Um, I shouldn't say goal, my big philosophy, truly. There's a lot of readers out there that will tell clients exactly what they think the client wants to hear instead of telling them what's in the cards or what their intuition is saying um, and they lead the client on and that's not me <laughs> it's never been who I am so sometimes I will deliver messages that are a little bit challenging but it's in everybody's highest and best interest in my opinion to hear the truth at the beginning um, I also really focus on self-love and that is where most of my coaching and workshops are geared towards at the moment. Self-love is the root of everything. If we don't have proper self-care, if we don't have proper self-love, if we don't have good routines, we're not manifesting or we are manifesting things that we don't want. So we are creating relationships that aren't healthy for us or we are repelling relationships that we want. We are creating jobs that are not healthy or we are having trouble manifesting the things that we desire. So self-love really is a big component to my manifestation practices and what I teach my clients. Um, so that's really the majority of what I do. Um, I also have an herbal shop, an Etsy shop that right now that I'm slowly expanding of products of how to help you through some of your magical abilities, help you through your practices. Um, I just started going, um, 
going in going public with all of that so I'm not very big with sharing all of my practices when it comes to witchcraft when it comes to my products at the moment um, I will be expanding more of that as time goes by but right now my focus is more about my clients getting readings done empowering them in the best I can helping them with self-love and improving manifestation and really just moving forward on their path on their journey to life and getting through every day being happy being healthy being in a place of love and compassion for themselves and for others instead of feeling lost or confused or frustrated so that is the general story of me like I said, I was a teacher for many years, and I will give a more focused story of myself as time goes by. My website is melsdivinationreadings.com. You can find it in my profile. I also have a Facebook and an Instagram that I am working on being more active on.